Hopefully for good. But our detritus will loom. Before you arrived at the bulwark, I was approached by the most unusual young undead woman. She swore enmity against the Cigar Crusade, so I sent her to work on her enemies to the north. You say you saw dead crusaders earlier? Those were probably her work. Go check up on her, and see if she can use any assistance in her vendetta against crusade. Though I wouldn't be surprised if she's already killed them all. A deadly new ally. Who could it be? Oh, I, I couldn't guess. Not at all. Can I go through here? Might be able to. It just means they don't have to skirt around over this way. Aw, oh, come on. Meh. Alright, fine. Okay, random forsaken watchtower. Gotcha. Ooh, I can do this just by holding down right, uh, the right mouse button. I can, not, uh, I can turn the, the character. Andy. That means I can just laze back. It's kind of why I like Duskers, because I could just enter in codes and let the, you know, characters do things themselves. Didn't need to actually control them. What can I say? I'm lazy. Okay, moving around the bear. Round. Right round, right round, like a wrecker baby. Spell that increases the damage they've done a uh, done by summon demons for a short time. Mm. All right. So you cast it and they're temporarily buffed. All right then. Ooh, we're in trouble. Well, not really. We'll call down a meteor and do some shadow bolts. Vicious Nightweb Spider. Can I be honest? I swear I've seen the name Nightweb elsewhere in Duskwood. I won't know for a while, though. Could look it up. I can't be bothered, though. Um, then again, did I see them over here? Yeah, Nightweb's Hollow. They're there. Hmm, cool. Uh, but I do wonder if I saw them in Duskwood as well. I know they have some spiders there, larger than these. Uh, but I wonder if they're also called Nightwebs. Probably not, but it's always possible. No flavor text on the venom. I wonder if you know the sh extra shards dissipate after a bit. I know it sends you back over time, out of combat, and over time you gradually go back up to tree. I think, but I don't know if it gradually brings you back down to tree if you're over it. Okay. For anyone who doesn't know my recording style, I figure I may as well say it while I'm here. Um, I'm thinking of it. I sit down and I just record for as long as I can. I just keep recording, I keep talking. And I have uh, exploits just auto-cut my videos into 20-minute segments. Um, I remember before explaining this, like, as to why I'm getting cut off mid-sentence. And I got cut off mid-sentence. Um, but yeah, basically that's why I have, uh, you know, exploit auto-cutting things on the 20 minute mark. This way I don't have to edit, which is especially good considering exploit's editor can only handle so much, uh, uh, so much footage. It's like 10 gig, and the editor is actually quite substandard anyway. So, yeah. Okay. 
needs two more bits of venom. So I'm just gonna distract again. I'm worried I said something earlier that I can get sued for. I won't say what. Christ. Uh, serious sulk. Okay. What's the sulking about? Oh, sorry, skulk. Yeah, different. Bit of a difference. Um, but yeah, I'm just paranoid. Um. Oh, brilliant, I'm done with that. I'll kill you as while I'm here. Um. Christ, it's huge. It's kind of disturbing looking. Um. But, anyway, um, yeah, I'm just paranoid. Uh, it's probably fine. Ooh, um, meh. I'll just wait for some quest items. There's no need to use... Re in reality, there's no real, um, uh, need to use the greens you find. The quest, you'll be getting quest rewards anyway, so... Probably better off holding on to... Holding out, holding out to them, and just selling off the greens that you do get. To vendors or auction houses, really. If you get a blue from a random thing, then that's something different. But you you know, if you're getting um like a world drop blue, yeah, you may want to use it. But if you're getting a um just random greens like that imbued disciple stash sash, no real need to use it. Well, so it seems like she's had some fun here. As you walk over the ruins of the camp, you hear a whisper behind you. I could kill you right now if I wanted to. You'd better watch your step on that. Ooh, what's this? Uh, demonic empowerment empowers your demon uh, active demons with dark energies, increasing their haste by fifty percent and he health by twenty percent for twelve seconds. It's, mm, okay, it's not really that great right now. The whisper continues. My name is William Voss. Before I died, I was a member of the Scarlet Crusade. My father, High Priest Voss, trained me to be a weapon against the plague. I studied stealth, sorcery, martial arts, anything to make myself stronger. I gave up my childhood for him. Then, as fate would have it, I died and returned as this. My father instantly forgot me, and when I returned, ordered me executed. Come, we'll speak with him now, in his tower to the northwest. I'm listening. So, yeah, she can do this. Which is uh, which are abilities that no one else has. Some people were saying that her abilities make no s uh, Okay. Some people were saying her abilities make no sense, but it makes sense if you, like, look, look she studied, you know, a ton of random sorcery. Um, oh, I'm surprised. Uh, random sorcery, martial arts, you know, random different things. Maybe there's a few things she studied that she, from the way she worded it here. There's a few things that you po quite possibly studied that you didn't list. So. Um. There we go. Um. Oh, buddy, how sorry. The burning sensation in my throat is distracting me from what I'm trying to say. I'm nearly out of coke. Uh, yeah, maybe some of her abilities are from things she didn't list there. You kind of want to list them there, though. But I'll put all this weird purple flame stuff down to um, the sorcery and whatnot. So, yeah. Just no one else has ever shown that sorcery is probably the issue. But, eh. I know. I just can't really bring my bring find my find it in myself to care too much. It is a bit of a weird thing, but it's I know it just doesn't bother me too much. Eh. Um, like it's under you know it's fine if it does bother you, but it doesn't you know for you know surprisingly for once it doesn't really get under my skin. So, yeah. Like, I think the reason is I can just put it off as, well, she says she studied these things, so it must be one of those. 
even though we've never seen anyone else do it, I guess it's just something special, you know? There's some Vanguard and Neo Faith and a Neo Faith. Damn it. Okay. Um, oh yeah, I can't remember doing this. Yeah, to bring him in and start, like, blitzing, you know, blitzing him down quite well. Oh yeah, just gradually start insta-killing them. Dude, that is funny. Uh, it's a good, very good idea to have an AoE spell, like I do here. That way, when she pulls him in, you can just hammer him down. It's actually a good idea to tack on multiple groups. Well, oh, sorry. Not tack on multiple groups. It's a good idea to... Well, um, try and, you know, kill off everyone up here, uh, on your way here, because she one-shots them, bit by bit, so if you pull too many at once, she'll, um, if you pull too many at once, you'll get overwhelmed, but if you just pull, like, you know, uh, the five there, she just demolished them, and I got all, and I got all but one, as, you, uh, only, we pulled five, I got the loot of four, or whatever. One she killed before I got a hit off on them. I need a target. Damn it! Stop that! Damn it, one of them I didn't get. It's a little annoying, but whatever. It. Uh, the reason I'm saying that you should hit them is because it gives you an extra bit of, uh, no, like, you should get them uh, as many as possible here. It's because it could make it easy to get an extra little bit of caught, which can be useful. Uh, certainly Lenin won't go for much, but it's, it's nice, you know? Just haven't looked down there. I've never been acknowledged down there. And there used to be a quest there in that aisle there. You had to go recruit a mage that was on, on the middle of it. But um, that's been removed. What? What? Why were you spared? Hit it. Weirdly, they didn't take any damage from the meteor falling. I think maybe it's because the guy d got uh, killed, just as she was doing. Just as she, um... Well, sorry. The guy got k killed by her, just as meteor came down. So, yeah. Maybe that's why? Excuse me. Okay, how much women do I have? 63. Remember the, um, Torn was saying that their fear of the arcane is growing. Well, clearly not, they're clearly not scared of it over here. But then again, it, he's referring to later on content. So maybe they're fine with it now, but later on they're more concerned over it. I have no idea. Okay. was hoping that'll play out slightly differently, so I missed out a bit of loot there. But regardless, I still got a fair bit, and I will actually be taking a pop down there to get that. Um, um or vein. Um, so we're gonna pop up here. Come on, start channeling, start channeling, start channeling. Come on! What the hell? Wait, am I still getting the loot? Hmm. Hmm. I t Maybe I got a hit off on most of them? I didn't think I did. Uh, but whatever, I'll accept the loot. 
I thought I met, uh, the AoE spell only hit a few of them. Uh, well, maybe it hit one guy. But no, it seems it hit more than what I thought it did. I'll well, hit the vanguard. Yes! Okay, we'll just leave her finish them. Yeah, she can tank it. Actually, no, I think her mana's too well to do her tank. Ooh, even they can get empowered. Nice. Though I don't think they'll last long enough to take a full advantage of it. No, they don't. And I'll pop down there when I'm done here. Doesn't really seem like there's many people on, so it's not like I'm gonna ex exactly lose the ore to anyone else. I don't know what ability they're doing there. You know, with the shield peering above their head and all that. Like a bodyguard, the a Captain Malrak, and her father Benedictus. Hit them all. She shouts her father. Oh, seriously? Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, that was hilarious. Um, if you didn't get what happened there, folks, I aggroed the three NPCs, thinking that's what I was meant to do. Because remember, she has a one-on-one -on -one with her father. And I figured that you had to aggro him, weaken him a bit, a week off the other two, before the one-on-one -on -one happened. The little heart-to-heart. -heart. But no, by aggroing them, I kind of wrecked the conversation, I think. And uh, the enemies still, like, while well, I was phased out so I couldn't see them, they could see me. And here, she back. And here she's back again. Or we'll summon Imp. Hey, Benedict is there and friendly. These other two aren't. She shouts, Father. Lillian, you're... It's so nice to see you well. It's, it's multiple versions. Shite. Shut up. You raised me to be a killer. How am I doing, Daddy? I, uh... <laughs> they're both responding. But wait. I remember now. You told me only to kill the undead. So, do you want me to kill myself, Daddy? Lily and I. <laughs> Not gonna kill the other one? Huh? Guess you're the next one of her daddies. Uh, Lily and I. Then again, why kill myself when I can kill you instead? I swear I remember a version of that where she climbs the tower. I wanna look that up. Uh, let's just find it here. Okay, let's see. No. 
Sorry, I'm just having a look here. Um, I was on Wowhead earlier, and um, 